What is that? Is that like... That's an... It's an ogre, isn't it? I've never faced one down. Ugh. That's the sound of an alligator. Well, he doesn't seem to be noticing me. I think this is where the, uh... The light was coming from, isn't it? Something around these parts. Keep an eye on that ogre. We don't want anything to do with it. What was light? Ah, again with the food. Hi, ogre. Let's stay here on the beach. I have a feeling the sludge pit is, is a bit like the quagmire in that it um, takes away from me just to be here. Do we want, oh, that's where the light was. Yep, lava pit. I was kind of hoping it was something all mystical. Because there's mystical stuff. Especially once you get into the uh, twilight zone. Twilight Zone. Haha. <laughs> twilight Forest. Die, man, die. Stay out of the sludge. Love the Ents, they're great. I don't want to spend a lot of time in this uh, biome, though. It really seems unhealthy. Definitely running out of food faster than I'm used to. Ooh, what's hopping up and down? Is it food? Is it edible? What is it? It's a panda! And a bear bear. And there's a snake. Huh. I've killed bear before. Hi. I'm going to leave it alone since it's not attacking. I don't know what's hissing. It's probably another Gila monster. And it wants to make me dead. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Is this still a sludge pit? Sure is. Mm. I kind of wish I'd stayed over by that big sandy... Probably extreme hills desert or something. Dull like that in naming. Now, is it a landmass or an island? You know, swimming is not a good way to conserve my uh, food consumption. That's a different kind of tree. That's going to be outside the sludge pit. Right. Here we go. It's noon. I mean, I'd eat the zombie flesh if it came down to it, but that won't really do me a lot of good in the long run. It's like just planes there. There's usually food animals will grow on planes. Last time I played, uh, I had ostriches spawning all over the place. And they had pretty good food. Big old chickens. What are we? We are planes. Little strip of planes. Little plane strip. <laughs> Once I have a, a bit of a, a home base to feel safe at, I'll be a little more uh, adventurous with uh, facing down big, bad, mean things. <laughs> I didn't want to get it anywhere near that ogre. The last one I saw wasn't wearing armor, and that one looked like it was. 
I don't know if it's an ogre or an orc or some similar big beastie. But unless I kill it and it drops something called ogre meat, I won't know for sure. And so I'll call it what I feel like calling it. So there. Oh, I'm definitely running out of food. Oh, come on. This is a great place for animals to spawn that are edible. Oh, I hear a cow. We're in luck. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. We will cook cow meat. And now a cow meat cooking interlude. What I'd like to do is play theme from a summer place when I do that. It's just one of those recognizable bits of soft music. It happens to be played in The Shining. It's the reason I kind of like it. But I had one of my videos flagged for that, even though it's you know just kind of a an instrumental that's been around I think the 50s. Percy Faith Orchestra. You can sort of think that's old enough to not not be trolling YouTube for copyright infringement. Oh well. So I stick to royalty free and stuff that's even older. Like I say, my opening bit is Duke Ellington, East St. Louis Toodaloo, 1933, from the Smithsonian Archive. You don't get much more public domain than Smithsonian Archive. Unless I'm wrong. <laughs> I was in a dance performance once, and my bit was to that song. Alright, do I have enough wood to make another boat? I do not. Chop a tree? Chop a tree. like leaving floating trees, even if I'll never be back here again. There. It's a dirt tree. Two boats. Out of the really murky biomes. Now that's something lit up, right? Is that another birch ent? I wonder if ent originated as short for entity. I bet it did. Good old JRR isn't around to ask. It's a lot of them. I thought they were rarer than that. I think there's one over on the beach here, too. Or some other tall, birch-colored thing. Ooh. No, that's not an ant. That's... What is it? No, it is an ant. I just couldn't see its lower half. That's an ant as well. 
So many ants. Look how short the creeper looks next to it. <laughs> Normal vanilla monsters. That's an autumnal forest, I think, is what that's called. Oh, I lost all my pumpkins from before. Dang it. Oh. Stay. Oh, depth. <laughs> I thought for sure I was going to break my boat on that little bit of dirt. I have a feeling I've gone over time, so this will probably be split into two-parter. 11 and 12? actually find out. Give me a sec. Well, we are going on three times the length I normally am aiming for. <laughs> so I could split it three ways. Which, honestly, I'm, I'm loath to do because it hasn't been a particularly action-packed adventure. Although you did see death. I died. And I killed things. All right, yes, I have been here before. I turned back last time. The birch forest. Savannah. That's called a savannah. With acacia trees. I was drawing a blank on it earlier. Oh. You're land. You're not water. Don't do quite as good on land. In a boat. Or a boot. Ooh, ice. Oh, look at that. Is that more quagmire? Now we know to skirt around it. The same quagmire? Or are we on an island? What's that? There's a quagmire village. Oh boy. That is a werewolf. I'm not going in there until dawn. It's midnight. So I am perfectly willing to wait here until dawn. You don't have to. So I'm going to pause. And when I come back, rosy finger dawn will be creeping across the sky. And we're back! I'm going to... I don't know where to land. I'll land here. Whoop! Wow! Bounced me way back. This is Quagmire, right? Dead Swamp. A close relative of Quagmire. Hello! Break, 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 break! Why aren't you breaking? You're not really there, are you? You're somewhere else. Where are you? Want some clay? All right, Mr. Boat. Right-clicking won't get in. It just doesn't exist. Fair enough. I've lost it. Lots of clay here. It won't help me in the other bit where I'm trying to collect clay. So, this dead swamp has a village and a dungeon. This might be a good place to hunker down for a while. Ooh, it's a good sized village. Woo! Snake. Some snakes attack. Hi, what you got? Whoa, 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 whoa! Gila monster. Go to hell. Rude. I have a feeling the swamp area will be full of those. What's that about? Ralph. The uh, gravestone mod uh, also creates a new class of villager, the Undertaker. 
Aha. Uh -huh. And we have one here. This, uh, sorry, I bumped the mic there. All right, let's see what we got. We will be attacked at least once. Meat and bones, 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 meat and bones. Meat and bones. Oh, something green came up. Zombie head. Meat and bones, meat and bones, and a record. Meat and bones, and meat and bones. Okay. No real great prizes. Mellow high. Oh, cookies. I must have got them from one of the graves. Because grave cookies are the best. Right, so if there's a cemetery, uh, this village should have an undertaker. There's one. Ah, armor. Armor's good. Boots. Boots and pants and boots and pants. Well, that's a nice thing to find in a grave. That's why we check them. Alright, let's see if we can find the Undertaker's shop. There may not be one, but I was under the impression that if a village had an Undertaker, I mean, if the village had a graveyard, I meant to add an undertaker. It may not be the case. I feel like I'm missing a part of the town. But I always feel that way. There's no particularly useful, exciting, or helpful houses. Alright. That's the one I just did. Well, let's see what's in the uh, in the chest at the top of the dungeon, and then we will call it a session, whether it be two or three episodes when we're done. You will know by the numbering. If it's in the 20 to 30 range, minute range, there will probably be three episodes in this session. I imagine some of these are different levels of difficulty, but they, they get harder the further down you go. When you get in. Dirt. Yeah, I'm going to be dumping a bunch of that stuff if there's anything good in the chest. I don't think the chest is a guaranteed thing, either. Oh, there. Now you can see the village perfectly. It's a nice spot. Ah. Holy crap. Look at all that stuff. We got laudanum, which we don't care about. We've got surplus pantaloons of archery and surplus pantaloons of defense. I suspect the pants I have now are better than those. Got a stone pickaxe. Got stone swords. There's some fish, which I want more than I want gunpowder bread, which I want more than I want a stack of bones. Alright. So, this is where I will make my stand for the end of the session. Missed. Oh, torches. And this will be my screenshot. Lovely. Alright, well, as usual, dear friends, we'll see you next time. Have yourself a lovely evening. And, uh, ooh, elephants. Mm -hmm.